Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back once again to Coral Island. He says recording it for the fourth time in a day. <laughs> this wasn't the plan. <laughs> you chicka paka. Goddamn crows, man. Goddamn crows. I can't, I, I'm not going to go get another skeleton. Uh, uh, hmm. Ooh, okay, what's this news? A flash increases growth rate. Interesting. Uh, sprinkler, an ultimate... Automatic watering system. Water's a radius of nine tiles. That sounds fantastic. <laughs> but uh, we need silver kelp and stuff like that, which is quite a uh, rare resource right now. We can make a compost bin. Turns trash into compost. Makes fertilizer. Yeah, okay. That sounds good. Grab one of these. So today, the... the sorry, I've got, some, I've got something in my eye. I'm blind. Ow, ow. <laughs> get out of my eyeball, whatever you are. Uh, let's get this going. Boop. Don't use all my trash because, as we've seen, trash is actually quite useful. Can I split? No. I don't think so. I'll do. So trash and organic. Okay, so we can turn anything into. A Compost. Um, right, so we need 17 more pieces of bronze ore to get the weapon upgrade. I've got several things to donate. We've got some food. I'm just going to stick you in potato. We're going to drop these off for now. These are all going in the museum, obviously. But um, I want to clear my inventory before the mining trip. Push that over there. What's in the mail? I want to know low and meet me at the general store when you have time. So you complete someone's request on a bulletin board. I'm impressed. Thank you. Okay, we'll do that next time. Not today, Sam. I'm sorry, buddy. Today, I just want to get to the mines nice and early. You know, it's nine. It's not even 9 a.m. It's 7 a.m. The mines aren't even open for ages. They're the store. So we can go to the mines. We can burn through all our stamina and stuff. And then if there's time at the end of the day, we can go and do other things. Sounds like a plan. I should have dropped my... Oh, I should have dropped these. Bah. Bah. Especially with... Oh, am I going to go back? I feel in my heart of hearts I'm not, but I feel like I should. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It won't be fine. I'm an idiot. It'll be fine. <laughs> We're going to hit level 10. That's the goal. Level 10, and we want 17 pieces of ore. And that's going to let us upgrade our pickaxe. Which will then hopefully make it easier to upgrade everything else. Is the hope. You think about it. It's also stamina efficient. Because I'm assuming... Upgrade the pickaxe. Maybe um, these take two hits, for example, and other rocks only take one. We burn less stamina while exploring. Lovely. Okay, so ooh. things like the morel we can we can drop. We're gonna eat the bread. We're gonna eat the sweets. We've got inventory space. It's not a big deal. <laughs> Sorry, itchy nose. All right, let's bish bash bosh. Oh, there we go. That's lucky. The primary goal is the ore. The secondary goal is getting to level 10. These little caterpillar do like I don't know if it's on purpose, but it just looks like he's wearing a little costume. It's like a monster in a caterpillar costume. It's, it's very cute. Oh, that's a lot of copper ore right there, baby. Very exciting. Absolute waste of stamina, but... It's like I say, it's what we're here for. Bong. Bong. Lovely job. How much are we on? Ten. Only need seven more. Not a bad start at all. Missed. Not a bad start at all. Anyways, how's it for doing? It's a beautiful new day for you folks. For me, it's, as I say, the same day as it has been for the last few episodes. I'm just addicted. It's just one of those games... You know, I started playing Overdin like six days ago, and I've recorded more of Coral Island than I have of Overdin. Because it's just such an easy pick-up-and-play game. There will come a time, I think, in the future of this game, kind of like we did with Animal Crossing, where I end up doing things like between the video, I think, you know? Or trimming videos down, maybe recording for longer and trimming the videos down. I don't know, I, I say that, but I never did that with uh, Sandrock, really. But, mm, but I don't know. We, don't, we don't need to worry. That's a future thing for future me to deal with. Future me's a nerd. Don't need to worry about that. What I will try to do going forward 
is record less episodes per day because it's better, I think, when time has passed and things are going on in my life. <laughs> so I can um, have more to talk about. And not much has changed since the last video, except that I got an Amazon delivery. Very exciting. Mystery Geode. Took that time, considering I've got 100% extra. I mean, it could be like 2% to 4%, so... <laughs> do, 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 do. Nice. Do, 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 do. You have to make those noises. Those are my combat noises, like the hacker from New Zealand. <laughs> Mine's just much more intimidating, obviously. Um, I'm trying to think about when you folks are going to see this series and about... So, the, the thing that I got from Amazon was for the new secret channel, inverted commas. So I'm trying to decide if you've seen the secret channel by now, and therefore can I talk to you about the secret channel by now? That is the question. I've been talking about it on this channel for so bloody long. Um, I mentioned in a previous video that I had a bit of a panic about it. The pa well, I had a bit of a panic yesterday. A, because the best slot challenge just isn't going well. My, my, I, I'm going to talk pretty openly about this. My er earnings have plummeted. I'm earning about half what I used to earn consistently. And I just can't seem to rescue it. I just can't seem to fix it. I just, I, I just, I can't figure out what I'm doing wrong. It just isn't. I just can't fix it. I just can't. No matter what I do. So that's why the secret channel inverted commas has taken on like extra importance. You know. So whenever there's like a <laughs> like a problem with the secret channel, it, it it suddenly becomes a lot heavier because I've put so much onus on it to like save me essentially. And the fact is, it might not. It might not work. And even if it does, it's a brand new YouTube channel. It's going to take some time. So I'm trying to temper my expectations, but I'm also aware that... So, for example, you know right now that um, I'm living at home. Um, things were going a bit rough, and I needed a break, so I just came back and hung out with my dad for a couple of years, basically. I was meant to be out by now. But obviously, my earnings kept going down. And I already pay £400 a month in, like, straight-up bills on a loan that I took for the secret channel. <laughs> so, it's at this point... What is this, by the way? Meant to be full already. That did not take long at all, did it? Right, I was just going to eat the morel. I'll just eat the bread instead of what am I doing. What is this? Oh, quartz. Very nice. Down we go. Level 10, I think. Level 9? Ah, level 9. So we just need to get through this one and we're golden. Um, but at the end of the day, there's a lot of onus on the secret channel. To at least up my earnings to the point where I feel comfortable again. Or like, not like a disaster again. Uh, I'm going to eat. They sell for more. They, they heal for less, typically. I'm gonna, I don't really want to eat these. Oh, do I care? No, not really. Um, oh, I don't really care about the slap either, though, it must be said. But the point is, there's a lot of onus on the secret channel to be a good thing to kind of help me out for the situation I'm in. My problem is, I don't... I, I, I want to be back living on my own, right? I, I love living on my own. I did it for years, no problems, and then I lost it. And it's been tough. I've talked about this before as well. It's, it's been hard on me in a lot of ways. And not that living with my dad's not great. That's I have no problems with my dad at all. He's good to live with. Yada, yada. But, you know... I'm off an age, <laughs> but living at home feels very weird. And I could probably survive even with my current income on my own, but it would be a rough living, you know? I, I wouldn't be having a great time. <laughs> I'm gonna have to eat this morale. Um, actually, um, yeah, we'll do it anyway. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check away the sap. I'm gonna eat the morale as well. But the point is, I want to get back on my own, but at the moment it just doesn't seem feasible. Like, I've been waiting and waiting for it to happen, but I don't know how I'm going to pull it off right now, because I just don't earn the money to do it. Or I could, but I wouldn't be living... I, I'd have to live in a hole, you know? I'd really have to live in a hole. So there's a lot in, like, my general life and my time and investment riding on this channel. And sometimes I, I look at the idea and I just and how it's going to function, because I've got some limitations in place, unfortunately. I look and I just think... Is this going to work? Is this anything? Is this just all building up to be a disaster? And you know what, folks? I don't bloody know. <laughs> Generally speaking, I feel okay about it, but sometimes it, it just gets me a little bit. Tool speed use. Okay, cool. All right, we might as well go as deep as we can. So yeah, I don't know. A couple, I'm, I'm feeling all right about it now. 
I, like I have to believe that I can make it work. But I, I had a bit, I had a bit of a panic. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Largely done with it now. I retain that it's a good idea, and I can pull it off. But I'm just not as confident as I would like to be. Let's see how it goes. Anyways, that was a good way to kill. There you go. There's my <laughs> ego falling in on itself like a dying star for the last ten minutes. Whoa, 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 Nelly. Whoa, girl. Okay. Well, at least we're leveling up our combat. Funny enough, because they start sleeping, they're actually easier to kill than the other things. Oh, yeah, that's pretty sweet. You know what this means, though? I'm going to miss so many more times. Like, I'm gonna get an extra hit in that I don't want so many times. I wonder if... I feel like I'm attacking quicker. I wonder if it counts for the sword as well. I just assumed it wouldn't, but it might do. I feel like a goddamn speed demon right now. I'm speed. Alright. Let's just keep going until we can't go anymore. We might not use the food, though. I might... Just because we're not, like, pushing... Like, I kind of want to save it until we're pushing for level 15. Rather than trying to drag this one out. And we've got a lot of good stuff today already, so... I think we're going to call it a day very soon. One little... Maybe a little jump down, though. <laughs> just in case we had something like this. Oh, what's that? Is that ginger? It looks like ginger. Why'd there be ginger down here? Don't know. <laughs> Why does she do that? Like, it feels like a really cool attack that I would like to utilize, but I don't know how. No, we don't need the wood. And it's ginger. Cool. Right, I'm gonna eat one of these. Just to make sure I can harvest this area completely. Even though we've got enough now, we, you know, we, we want to upgrade all our tools, obviously, so. The more copper, the better. Kill this dude for a little bit of combat XP. Damn it, show! Name speed. Alright, and we'll just burn through the rest of our stamina. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I mean, if I keep finding them, I'm going to keep doing them. Inventory full. For what though? What is that? It's like a elixir of some form. Um, no, 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 no. <sighs> Do I feel comfortable dropping any of this? Maybe the coal. Extra stamina for two hours. Oh, this is good stuff. Eh, you know what? Screw it. Live the dream. And that's why it's down here, right? It's it's too. Whoa! Oh, what's going on there? Is it charging? I don't know. I found the hole again. I don't know what's going on, but we are flying through. Now, I think it's I think it's increased my max stamina, hasn't it? Now it says two hours. Does that mean real hours or in-game hours? I'm hoping it's real hours because that's going to be a really good upgrade. And I, like I said, I'm not big on my consumables, but I'm not going to look a gift ginger in the mouth as they say. Do they say that? They probably say that. Oh, all right, okay, okay, okay. I mean, look, I'm gonna, gonna keep going. May as well keep going. Oh, I mean, I said before that the reason to not eat the sweets. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. We're not gonna find any geos or anything because I'm not smashing any rocks, but still, we are flying. Weirdly enough, combat doesn't use stamina, which is good. Okay. The torch has confused me. What the point? I don't know. Down we go. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Wait, this is 15 now. Is it 16 I need to get to or is it 15 I need to get to? I don't know. This is a weird room. No, it must be 16. That would make more sense. I think there's five enemy floors and then a safe floor. So it's 6, 11... Yeah, okay. 
Um, I mean, this is great. We're going to be able to upgrade so much of our equipment. It's pretty exciting. Did I get rid of the coal? Now I'm thinking, like, <laughs> I've got all this bronze ore. I don't actually have that much coal. Coal is going to become quite important, I think. Coal might actually limit me more than the ore at this point in time. Hey, give me, give me, give me these enemies to kill. Awesome. Ah, well, there's an elevator. So, I think it's every 10 floors. Ooh, every 10 floors must be the uh, the reward floor. You know where you get a chest? The time's it. It's 10 o'clock, though, so we shouldn't hang around so much longer. If my combat doesn't... I mean, it's already leveled up once, so I don't know if it's going to level up already. But um, <laughs> we've killed a lot of stuff. It's bash some regular rocks, I think. Going through this last bit of stamina that we don't need. Right. I'll do. Let's get out of here. That was a much, much more successful run than I could have possibly anticipated. Lovely stuff. That's not my beverage. Where's my, that's my beverage. I drank the wrong beverage. We are, however, going to need to rush if we're going to get home in time. I must be speed. Oh, I want the catapult. Oh. <laughs> but no, I must be speed. I mean, okay. Oh, wait, no, I've got no, I've got no inventory space. Leave it alone. <laughs> uh, snail. Oh. <laughs> I said it would be fine if I didn't drop the tools off, but you know what? If I dropped the tools off, I could have got a lot more stuff. Grumble, grumble. Do that in the morning. Wait, I've got a mail? What for? Hey, kid, I've noticed that the elevator for the Earthshaft reaches level 10. Since you've shown yourself to be capable, here's a task. Defeat 30 monsters. Oh. <laughs> it would have been nice to get that before. I suppose we only got to 10 at the end. No, we got to 15, didn't we? Did we get 15? We got the 15, didn't we? Yeah, so I kind of wasted five floors over for monsters. Oh well. I guess if I didn't level up, that's wild. Anyways, good first day. Alright, let's clear out the old inventory. So, the, uh, actually, I want the copper. I don't. Oh, yeah, I do. I need the coal and the ore. You do actually need to physically bring them over to the thing for this to work. We've got tons of ore. Um, slam goop, quartz, what's quartz for? Oh, gem for the thing, nice. The essence. I guess we just need to look. That would have been the idea last time when I was like, ah, do we donate this or not? Well, we just look and you can tell. Okay, we've got three geos to break, quartz to donate. Bronzor, we're gonna use mango steam, we're gonna sell? Question mark? Yeah, because it's one star, and that to me think makes me think I should sell it. Does that make sense? Because because of something? Because of reasons? You know reasons. I remember reasons. Do you remember? Re I remember reasons. Reasons are great. Okay, that's all our carrots. We're finally moving away from this left hand side. Um, I think we're selling most of this. I kind of don't want the. I've already got carrots, yeah. I don't want the lettuce to be a, a star lettuce for the same reason. Like, I want to sell the star stuff and keep the regular stuff. That might be my Paleo Pines influence corrupting me because that's exactly what I did in Paleo Pines. Right, let's get wet. I think we might have a diving day if we get this the uh, chance. We need to figure out how we would. I want to get the sprinkler, which is one of the reasons why we were diving. But then how would you place the sprinkler and the scarecrow in the most efficient way possible? Hmm. No, I don't need to worry about that yet. I'm hoping those tilled sections on the left will kind of untill over time. If not, we'll have to go around and do it ourselves, which I can't be bothered to do. Okay, all nice and juicy. Let's go crack open, crack open some stuff. What else are we doing? Um, we can, uh, um, 
sorry. Um. Temple store's not gonna be open. The blacksmith isn't open. I don't see the point in going to the museum yet, because. Hello, buddy! Butter! You think butter has the cutest eyes in the world? Maybe we'll go hit up this temple. It's up here, isn't it? I think. Oh, it's over there. Yeah. Ah, let's just wait till nine. It's fine. Slackers this town. I tell you, slackers. I'm up and Adam. I'm going to tell you what. Use this opportunity to catch a little beetle. You know, that's new. I don't recognize it. Hop Harless. Cool. Another thing for the collection. <laughs> Come here, little pigeon. I'm not going to hurt you. Ah, you. Let's go catch a fish as well with our spare time. Level up our fishing skills, level up our catching skills, level up all our skills. Come on, fishy. Hey, little fishy, 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 fishy. Oh, oh, oh. So I just got so much of this nonsense. So many flyers and trash. How are we doing on fishing? Can I see that? Where is it? It's nearly level one. Sort of. Not really. I don't know if leveling up helps. How does leveling help? I don't know. How does leveling count? Like I know I know we level and we get skill points. But like how does I don't know. How does the leveling help other than skill points? Is what I'm trying to ask. Because you don't get a skill point every level. So what does level one achieve? Like hit level one, and then you hit level two. Level two, you get a skill point. But what do you get at level one? Do you get anything? Anywho, crack open some stuff. Oh, wait, let me check this as well. So we need wood, which I'm pretty sure we've got tons of. If not, we can make some. We need bronze bars. We need five bronze bars. I don't know what we're going to prioritize so open, but we'll, we'll go sort that out in a minute. Oop. Boo. Yay. Yay. Good stuff. I think the um, the upgrade to occasionally destroy all the rocks in the area may have been the better idea. It sounds quite helpful now that I think about it. I'm going to whip up to the general store as well. See if there's any new errands we can run. Boo. And someone wanted a little chit chat, a little chin wag, as they say. Can't remember what this was about now. Oh, produce. Sam? Liddy, you've become quite the regular. Working hard at the farm. Hmm. Yeah. Good, good. I see you're getting much use of the shipping bin. Your shipment is always a huge hit with the town folk. I think we all miss the taste of local produce. Thousands of potatoes. <laughs> Here, let me show you something. Alright, but if this is like a meth lab, I'm not going to be impressed. This is our import section. Everything on this side is imported. I have to say, it's very expensive to get them here. The shipping costs, taxes, that sort of thing. They add up surprisingly fast. I've done my best to keep prices low. My margins are razor thin. It's just not enough. Any lower will go under. It's a local section. That's not going to... Oh, that won't do. A local section is so empty, really sad to look at. As soon as I receive your crops, I put them all here, and they're selling like hotcakes, flying off the shelves, as it were. It wasn't always like this. Wait, does this mean it's Sam who gets my butterflies and stuff? <laughs> Back in the day, where my trash. Back in the day, when my folks were in charge, the whole store used to be stacked from top to bottom with local produce. Something to be proud of. Now I have no choice to sell imported produce only. I'd love to reopen the local produce section, but need your help to do it. The task is simple. I need to ship a lot of bronze quality vegetables and fruits. Drop the exact amount on this note. Of course, I'll pay extra for this effort. I think extra coins on top of your usual crop commission when the whole order is filled. Hmm? Okay. So I'm assuming... Bloody hell. Well, it's just ship, isn't it? As in... Okay, so I just need... I mean, I'm already working on the potatoes. I don't have any fruit though. I can't I can't I can't do that. Until we get a fruit that we can plant anyway. So that's gonna have to wait until later. Stick it on the later base. 
All right, we're gonna hit up the museum, and then I think we're gonna hit up the um, diving for a little bit. Very nice. Halfway there. The town has this like real energy to it. It's really nice. You know, people are just you walk around and there's always something going on. People are always doing something. It doesn't feel like their lives are based around you, which is something that really annoys me in some games. I don't like this is gonna sound weird. I don't like feeling important in video games. <laughs> you know? Like I always thought a game where let's say there's a battle going on. Like like Dynasty Warriors style, but if you were weaker. Like imagine there's a huge, huge battle going on. And you are like one of thousands of nameless soldiers, just as likely to die. I mean, be, be a little less likely because you're controlling it, but no stronger than anyone else. And just being in there in the muck and the mire and everyone's going down and maybe you die super easily, you just respawn as another one or something. I don't know. I just think it'd be a lot of fun. I think there's value in, I think there's value in weakness. I don't know if I'm, ooh, nice. I don't know if I'm meant to catch those, um, Crabs somehow. Should have, uh, logically speaking, I really should have set the, um, the, um, oh, that's why you moved the anchor. <laughs> I really should have set the, uh, I will finish your sentence eventually, I promise you. Right, so there's, what, so there's two over here? Um, I should have set the, copper or all right here we go hello cheeky or neat coffer nice all right this is just this is quite a nice one that we can just nip in here and don't need to think much just burn our stamina oh very okay 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 <laughs> I'm assuming we're around here right so I'm assuming there's two of those things that we're looking for. But if nothing else, I'm cleaning the ocean. And that feels quite nice, actually. I wonder if I'm going to upgrade the scythe. Aha, here we go. We've got to prioritize what we use the most. The, the pickaxe is definitely the first thing I'm upgrading. Oh, yeah, so we've got one done, but we need to do this one as well. I see. Suggest I probably should have done this one first, but whatever. It's locked. Oh, maybe that first one led to the second one, though. Ooh. Maybe I don't do the second one. I'm confused. Oh, it gets rid of the, the black tentacle stuff. It's interesting that there's still another one in the area. I guess... It, oh, it must be down here, yeah. The thing is, though, because it's about cleaning the ocean, and that's something I care about, I kind of want to make sure I clear out all the trash anyway. Like, even if I don't have to, like, that area on the right hand side we're done with, right? But, you know, maybe I just clear out a little bit more trash. It's a shame there's no fish, though. I don't see any fish. And also, kelp is super hot. I haven't found any kelp at all. <gasps> Look at him. Oh, no, I need it. Yes, it's a sea slug. Very cool. Very, very cool. Looks cute, venomous, razor sharp teeth. Very, very cool that I'm excited about that. <laughs> In case it wasn't obvious. Uh, da, 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 da. I wonder if I get skill points. Is there anything I'm leveling up doing this? Again, is this, is this, should I be doing this? Is this stupid? I don't even see what it would be cleaning. But it's, it's suggesting there's another one, so I kind of want to keep going, you know? Mm, 
Is there anything I feel comfortable dropping? Okay, I've got one piece of glass. We can drop that. There's a thing here. I know, I know. It's okay. But kelp, yeah, kelp seems very difficult to find. I didn't find any in that entire exploration. Diving. Hmm. Hmm. Oh wait, is this kelp? <laughs> Should I be... Okay, just shut up. <laughs> I'll fix it, leave me alone. Alright, is there anything I feel comfortable dropping? Yeah, I don't need this. I don't know. Drop this. Can I... Oh, it's seaweed, not kelp. Well, I don't have seaweed, though. What about this? I don't know what any of these things are, so I'm just kind of experimenting. Can I eat the sea slugs now? <laughs> I don't know what this is. Let's find out. Ah, sea salt. Cool. Beep bob. Oh, right, so that... Is that kelp, then? I don't know. Let me have a look. Let's have a little peek. Means I have to clean my inventory yet again. Um, I'm sorry, flame scallop. Oh, I can't eat this. Uh, I'm just gonna chuck it. I think. Nice. Okay, that makes kelp seem <laughs> a lot more achievable than it did in the past. Just didn't. Didn't think. I, th I think that like, obviously we've picked it up in the past from a similar circumstance, but I don't think I ever realized that's what I was doing, per se. I wonder if I can get that starfish. Okay. Obviously, we have to get the starfish. Uh, I'll get rid of the stone. God, I need to increase my venery again. I'll get rid of the tulips. Yeah! Very cool. All right, we'll have a little swim around. See if we can find any more kelp. It's just a sea slug. That's fine. Kelpy, 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 kelpy. We needed what? I can't remember how much we needed. Okay, that'll do for now. It's not enough. We need four more, three more, because we've got one back at the house. But progress established let's get out of here it's it's why you need until we've got a bigger inventory we kind of need to decide what we're doing each day and then remove the tools we don't need because it <coughs> it kind of keeps being a problem fairly consistently I I think I think people do like if you talk to them I think it's just worth saying a quick word to people as you run past Vegetables? What vegetables? I know, Raj. I know, buddy. <laughs> I did, I've talked to Raj a few times now, and that's all he says every time. You butter. Hello, butter. Who are you again? Peanut. You want to be a cat and follow Peanut around all day? I mean, yeah. Who wouldn't? Okay, now we cleaned another little bit. Quite a few new things for the museum. Most importantly, just because I want to see the Big Boy Museum. That's really all I want. Uh, right. So we got a sea slug and we got a starfish. There it is. And there's the slug as well. Bopping his little head. Look at it. Raven in the top right. <laughs> Actually having a little rave. I'm surprised I don't have anything over here. I mean, I wouldn't expect any of those. We just got to be in there. But we have caught freshwater fish, haven't we? Um, I've got two coffers. Is there any chance that the thingy's still open, the blacksmith? Got nine till two? What? What? You can't operate from nine till two and expect to stay in bloody business. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's go back. Did I have a quest for my, um... No. The, um, blah, blah, blah. You know what I mean? You know what I mean. Yeah. Okay, that. 
Oh, no, 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 no. I really, really should have said. I mean, it'll, it'll, it'll do it overnight. Yeah. It's fine. Not potato. Jungle resources. It's just, I mean, look how many tools we've got by default. My entire tool belt is filled half the time, you know? No, I really, really should have done it overnight. No, well, do five more in the morning. Not a big deal. I bet you bye bye. This might be our first quadruple day, depending on how long this one takes. Hmm. Okay. That's interesting. The star, the bronze star, didn't add that much. Twelve. It cost forty to make it. I would say we need it for the quest, so we are going to fertilize to get that mission done. I think the implication is maybe that you should be um, making your own fertilizer. Wait, why am I winking at that? <laughs> you know, if you make your own fertilizer, you may as well use it on something, right? Like, there's no point in just having fertilizer for no reason. I mean, no. The stuff that makes the fertilizer, you may as well make, like, the compost. You use it to make fertilizer. What else are we going to use the compost for? Nothing. So we may as well use it to make fertilizer and get a little bit of a bonus. But it clearly isn't a humongous bonus. Do I need wood, by the way? Yeah, not that much, though. Well, I, I've burned through that coal in no time. All right, I want to go open these coffers. Um, you're all looking lovely. What else are we doing with our time? What do you need again? Yeah, so I think we can turn the compost. Bear with me. <laughs> oh, no. So how do we turn... Is it a crafting thing? It must be a crafting thing, right? Ah, yeah, okay. Oh, that's why I need to keep the sea scavenger balls. Oh, it's only for growth rate, though. I don't really care about that. Hmm. Oh, right. Yeah. Okay. Well, you see my point, though. We may as well use it, because we're not using sap for anything else. Yada yada. Okay, so. You're whirring away. Um, we can upgrade something. I kind of want to go... I know it's a bit dark. I kind of want to upgrade everything at once, but we should probably go upgrade... An item. Considering it says it's going to take a day. It shouldn't be in there. Oh, of course. I forgot that we had these. More things for the museum. And then we might just go diving again. I really want to try to get... I can't remember how much kelp we needed. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take it with me, because we're going to take it to the lab. Um, I know it's 20 for the crafting thing. Uh, the extractor. Which I can't see, because I'm blind. At the top right. But it, I don't know what it, I mean, we don't have any scrap anyway. But it might be a lot less for the upgrade or whatever the heck they were talking about. So I've got bronze, I need wood. Sorry, I'll stop. Uh, yeah, we'll keep the canola. And whatever. All right, that'll do. Let's go. Lots to do. Every day is a busy day. As they say in the clubs. Probably. It's only seven in the morning again. Well, we can hit up the museum first. I just I want to go to the museum after we've gone to the blacksmiths. You know, it's just kind of the logical way of doing things. You know me, Mr. Mr. Logical. There we go. Zebrafish, octopus. That's a big one. And a moth. And we get a reward. Oh, nice. Bronze ore. And some kelp. Oh, actually fantastic. <laughs> really well timed. Good stuff. Uh, where's the lab? What time's the lab open? Where is the lab? I actually don't know this. Any ideas? <laughs> Can somehow tell me through the time-space continuum? Uh... 
Um, oh, a blacksmith's closed today. That's a pain in the ass. Where did they... Where, I was meant to take the kelp somewhere. I don't remember... Wait, I'm going to have to Google this. Have to bear with me. Because I, I do not remember where it is, and it's annoying me. Um, bronze, kelp, coral, island. I figure if I pause, I don't burn through my day. Bronze kelp is mainly obtained by cutting bronze kelp at a depth between 10 and 20 meters. Blah, 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 blah. Laboratory, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Bronze kelp can be processed. Wait, no. Where am I meant to take this? <laughs> um, it's the lab. I think it's the lab. Where's the lab? Closed on Saturdays. Oh, there it is today. Do you have a map? Do I just? Are you expecting me to find this with my brain? Because <laughs> that seems likely. <laughs> Unlikely. Um, all right, I guess so. But well, at least I know there's a lab, and that's what we're looking for. Uh, what day is it today? Sunday, so it should be open. I've got to remember that the blacksmith is shut on Sundays. <laughs> um, well, there's Link. That's got to be it, right? Well, no, but Link's not at the lab. Oh, it's there. Link's lab. Closed. Why? It's not AM. It's not AM. Okay, but I found it. Go, go, go. I just, I need to go to every building at least once and kind of like fold it away in my mind place, you know? And what a terrible day for the blacksmith to be shot as well. <laughs> like, really, really bad. I wanted to upgrade my stuff. I wanted to open things. There's a lot of things I wanted to do today. Upgrade produce quality. This is what I wanted. Okay, seed upgrade level one, increase the chance to yield higher quality crops. Increase it. Okay, so it just. And then fertilizer maybe takes you to the next level. Right, so I do actually need to make it into essence though. Bronze hay. Saplings. No, we, I mean, we'd upgrade the seeds, surely. Alright, okay. What else do you have in the shop? Wait, how do we get fossils? <laughs> oh, you actually sell kelp as well. That's cool. All right, cool. So we can go make the extractor now that we have enough. And uh, we need five kelp essence. So we probably need quite a lot more kelp. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the house. We're going to drop off needless stuff. We're going to make an extractor and then we're going to go back diving again. I think. There's a lot to do, folks. <laughs> there's always, there's always going to be something to do, which is, in parts, fantastic, and in parts, slightly overwhelming. So let's drop some stuff off. I wonder if I can. I really need to get some more coal as well. I just want to hit ten, if possible. Can I? Uh... Yeah, I think so. Okay, yeah, it only uses one coal per, so. We're gonna get enough for that, at the very least. Okay. Put the coffers away till tomorrow. I need a third box, I've decided. <laughs> uh, right, so how do we make this extractor? Oh, I still don't have enough. What am I missing? So, how do I get scrap? Is it just from. Scrap recycled from trash. Can I build? Oh, the way I saw a, I saw a um. Let me, let me take my trash. Let me take my trash. I saw there's a recycling center there, which I've never been to. So I'm guessing that's where I want. Let's go. Let's go give that a go. Actually, tell you what. While we're doing that, we'll clear our inventory off needless things, which is basically everything. Temporarily. We'll go recycle our trash like a good wholesome person and then we'll hit up the diving for a little bit as well. Next time we'll go to the Lake Temple. I keep seeing it at the top thinking, well, I should really, I should probably do that. And then, oh, I should have kept my book now. 
Never, never drop the bug now. You never know what you'll stumble upon. I kept the um, the sword just in case. I don't know what lurks in the depths, you know. Oh, what? All right. I guess we just have to hope for the best. Okay, that's fine. I'm, I, it'll be something we activate later on in the game, obviously. I mean, we have found scrap, obviously. We've got five of them. But it's going to take a long time to get 15 more. Oh, well. What is a boy to do, eh? What is a boy to do? Am I going the right way? <gasps> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what that was. <laughs> Terrifying. Just follow the big lovely octopus. Oh, I really shouldn't have dropped my net. Oh. You know, the house is really... I'm going to knit back to the house. Because obviously we need the net if we're going to go down into the... Um... Oh, and that's... Ah, oh, I never dropped the net. Never dropped the net. The net is God. <laughs> Wait, no. How am I going to get back to the... Oh, no. I can't... Ah! Okay, that, that, that is a new task for me as well. Spend a day clearing out a path between this area and the um, and the farm and hay place. It's got to be the right way, right? Yeah. Burning, burning daylight here, folks. Burning daylight. Ah. Okay. Put this trash away since we don't need it. Okay, so all I need is the net. That's a daft way to do it, but that's how I'm going to do it. I guess we don't need the mine. The, um... I need to rename general nonsense into life stuff or something. Anyways, right, so we've got everything we need for a very, very short trip down underwater at this point. But hey-ho, a trip's a trip. What a froggy. It's got to be a way to go. Can I get these? Oh, nice. Shiitake. <laughs> Shit take. <laughs> As they're often called. I see the wasabi. I'm resisting the overwhelming temptation to go grab the wasabi. Because I've got things to do and limited time. Let's get wet. Let's clean up some trash. Okay, this one is still throwing me for a loop. It makes me want to clear out this area. You know I'm not sure how useful that is. I'm going to do it anyway. So yeah, in terms of things we're going to upgrade, I suspect... Um, the... Uh, oh, there, there we got some scrap there. It's going to be the pickaxe. I think it's probably the pickaxe and the scythe. I'd guess. Oh, we got more scrap. Okay, this is how we get scrap. <laughs> Which makes sense, because it's, it's upgrading something relative to this, isn't it? So Now we can actually pick these things up as well. I don't know. Oh, very nice. Oh, little sea slug. I don't need you right now, buddy. It's okay. I don't feel like stealing you away <laughs> for no reason. Hmm, maybe I should have brought my I don't know if I can use my pickaxe on those, like, sea rocks. Maybe I can. pieces of trash. 13 to go. They make you work for it, don't they? Lots of coffers, though. It's cool. <laughs> I don't know if I'm missing something here. And that this isn't what you're meant to do. <laughs> but I don't, I don't see what else you are meant to do if it's not this. We can't progress until we clear the area, aren't we? Well, I'm trying to activate this one up here, obviously. Hey, clear all the trash. I mean, if you clear all the trash, there we go. You know that you've got it right, right? There's nowhere for the evil to hide, i.e., the trash. <laughs> it's really annoying me. <laughs> I'm gonna go back and try to get it. Up 
your pop buddy. He has saved the world. And looks sexy at the same time. Pshow! That's my sexy voice. <laughs> in case you were curious. Um. See, that now opens this area down here, which we didn't have access to before. But I kind of want to focus on getting all of them. I think if I start skipping ahead, I'll, I'll end up annoying myself. So I'm just going to make sure we get every one of these as we go down. i got to stop. <laughs> as I keep tapping B, like, I can't get out of that habit. Tap B, tap B, tap B. Unfortunately, she does not have an underwater dive. So yeah, kelp seems uh, really useful. And the mining, I guess the mining helps your farming because you get better materials. But not as much. The the diving seems more relevant to the, the farming aspect. But the farming is less a focus in this game than I thought it was. That's not a negative by any stretch. Or a positive. It's a, it's a, it's a nothing. <laughs> it's, it's neither good nor bad. It's just, it, it is. That's a, that's a very much a YouTuber reaction that I just had there. Because some people say when I'm commenting on Evolution 2 feel like I have a tendency to be overtly negative. And I've never found that to be the case. I always found that I just sort of said what I felt was the truth. I don't, you know, hype things up as negative or positive for, for, for clicks, generally speaking, because I don't bloody get any. Maybe I should start. <laughs> um, but the point is, I don't feel like I tend to do that. Oh, well, I, I didn't see you somehow. Where the heck is this one then? Because there's no bloody, there's no trash. I am sans trash. God, I've only found two scrap in this whole thing. I really hope they're going to give us a better way to get that because it's it's not seeming... <laughs> it's, frankly, it's not seeming like it's in the realm of possibility at this point in time. Maybe... Oh, see, this is... Hmm. Maybe in order to open a recycling sensor, we need to progress in this, though. So maybe I should try to focus on progressing the cleaning things for now. These things. And then we can always come back and um, clean up the rest later on. I know I said I wasn't going to, but I will. <laughs> oh, there we Hey, that was nice. That was very nice. Where are you off to? Over here. Nice and early, that one. What's the kelp in the area? Help you in a minute, buddy. We need to clear a lot. There's a lot of trash in this area. Bloody Nora. Yeah, I think we're upgrading the scythe and the pickaxe. If I can, if I can do two, it's pickaxe first, but then it's scythe next. I think that's the logical order based on how the game's playing. I know it's blocked, you little numpy. You know, little robot, I want to love you, but you're just a pain in the ass more than anything. And I don't think you've added anything to my experience. <gasps> it's a seahorse. I think it's a seahorse. Nice! A tiger tail seahorse. Very cool. I think that's done, right? Lovely jubbly. So that's what? Three done? There you do your thing. I'm gonna start clearing over here. I'm assuming this one. See, this one's got a more obvious location where the others would be. Which is obviously down this way. Sea mushrooms! Oh, there's a lot of stuff down here, actually. What's that over there? It's like a crystal. Is it? It is literally. <laughs> I was kind of taking the mick a little bit, but it's it's a sea mushroom. Oh hello, mysterious coffer. Okay, okay. I, God, we need to get to this blacksmith. Got so much stuff waiting. No stamina left. Get a little bit more in, and then we'll call it a night. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, but there's a. Wait, 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 wait.
Totally worth it for the crab. Totally worth it for the crab. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm, okay. I'm just going to pop this morel. Shiitake. There we go. We're fine. <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs> what are you complaining about? Okay. Let's hit up the museum because we've got a couple more yet again. And then we'll call it a day. I was like, good little... Yeah, I, I, like, I like getting the sea creatures. That makes me happy. It's cool. It's cool, cool, cool. Oh, man, I love this game. And I shouldn't... Like, it's one of those games where I feel like in a lot of ways I shouldn't... I should be more critical of it because I'm aware that it's it's nothing unique in a lot of ways. Isn't the tropical vibe is a little bit different, you would suggest? I would suggest. <laughs> um, but beyond that, there's not much unique to it, is there, really? But it, it just has all the satisfying things that I like in the games. And since Animal Crossing 2, or New... What, what was Animal Crossing? I want to call it New Hope, but I'm pretty sure that wasn't the title. New World? No. Why have I got new in my head? Animal Crossing... Anyways, whilst we wait for a new Animal Crossing, this doesn't seem to be forthcoming anytime soon. This works for me, you know? I don't know if I should be selling these. I am. <laughs> I mean, the sea salvageables, we need it for the other thing, for the... Uh... I need money as well, so that's what it is. We'll get more. We'll get more. It's fine. Okay, oh, we need... Oh, sweet, actually, actually. Yeah, actually. Should be enough. So we should actually we might need um I need more coal. As I said I said coal is gonna be the the hold off on this. I mean true as it is. Um we need eleven more pieces of scrap. But we have for tomorrow eleven coffers. That's actually two hundred and twenty that's quite a lot of money. <laughs> Um, but we've got oh, eight. I can't do maths. Eight ornate coffers. One mysterious coffer. Very exciting. Don't need geodes, do I? No. Let's just grab all the stuff we're going to end up on. So we're going to want the bars as well. There we go. Knew I'd figure that out. I cannot remember how much wood we need. I'm going to take all of it and hope it's enough, but I don't think it is. Um, okay. I think we're looking pretty good. What's that Morel doing? What are, they, what are all these doing here? Ow, get out. This is like growth stuff. Oh, I need my, um... Bear with me, folks. Bear with me. Really need that inventory upgrade. It feels like the most important thing I can get right now. Um, okay. Yeah, so Betty Bye Bye's. Tomorrow, open up a bunch of things. Really excited about that. And um Yeah, probably something else. Diving level one, finally, so we can get a scuba snack or a vortexinator, whatever the heck in the heck that is. I keep waking up in this most depressing house. <laughs> I've already got a lot of money. Scuba snack. Craftable snack. Okay, so the good thing about that, though, is that we can harvest the seaweed whilst we're down there and then make it whilst we're diving, right? And just use that to sustain ourselves. Generates a small vortex. Oh, it's a bomb. It's a, it's a dynamite equivalent for under the water. All right, that's cool. We're getting there. No, we're not, really. <laughs> but we could be. You don't know. Uh, okay. So, I think we're going to keep focusing on Into the Ocean, because we're very close to doing that. And... That is about it for my immediate priorities, really. I don't really have anything else in mind at this point in time. Obviously, we're going to open all the stuff. We're going to go upgrade a couple of our tools as well. Mm, maybe we'll upgrade... Oh, I need to think about that, actually. We're probably going to upgrade... Wait, how many bars do we have? Is it 15? 10? <sighs> we'll upgrade the scythe today and then go... Because it takes a day, so I think we maybe lose access to that tool. So we want to upgrade one of them. So we want to upgrade the scythe and then go to the mines. And we want to upgrade the pickaxe and go underwater. So 
our next two days are going to be those two things. Then we'll hit up the temple. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. I'll see you lovely folks later. Thank you so much for joining me. Cheers, much as always. Bye-bye. <laughs>